guys welcome back to my channel i'm super excited to be doing this video for you guys um as i mentioned in my previous videos i've been bulking for almost a whole month and now it's time to get back into my cutting phase i did a supplement video on it and i'm working on showing you guys a how do you bulk so i bulk for a whole month i got a lot of clips a lot of footage the only thing is, is the only thing is it's so much that i'm doing it piece by piece but it will be done by the end of the month so you can see how to bulk healthy and also how to transition because you don't want to just start eating you don't just want to have a calorie plus you have to do it gradually but I know that you already heard me saying this a thousand times. So let me just tell you what I have for you today. Today I have how to make a healthy snack and how to make a healthy lunch. As well as showing you a quick workout that you can the comfort of your home. That's right. I'm going to be working out at home just to show you guys that you could work out anywhere. In an office, in a park. There's no reason why you should not be working out. So let's get right to it. I started off with cycling. I did 35 or 45 minutes of intense workout with my girl Camila from the Peloton. Go check her out. She's amazing. Love her. I decided to go and set up outside to do my push up and just finish my workout for the day. I'm not going to show you the five sets, but it's the same thing. You're going to do push up for five sets of eight reps right after your cycling. Make sure to hold your abs in as you're doing your push-up to protect your lower back. My camera decided to play hide and seek just as, just as I was about to record. As you can see on the screen, you are going to be crushing three sets of 15 reps side to side as well as air squat. We're all about power, working those obliques and sculpting those legs. With each side to side move, feel those muscles engaging and embracing your strength. So do not forget your air squats, the ultimate lower body burn. As you lower, focus on the perfect form, keeping your core engaged and those glutes activated. Go ahead and drink your protein shake. I went ahead and put my one scoop with my water and I enjoyed it. I decided to drink my protein with water today just because I had enough energy and I thought I did not need the extra energy right now. But boy, was I wrong. I was so tired at the end of the day. So right after my protein, I went ahead and took a bath. Just put my little rope just to show you guys my chia seed. So let's get right into the recipe. Guys, I have morning little fluffy. They're not really slippers, but look how cute and they're so comfortable. They're so comfortable. I think I got them on Target, eight bucks. So as promised, we're going to do a chia pudding. No, chia seed pudding. So all you need is milk, chia seeds, vanilla, syrup, and if you want to add fruit on top, you could, but, we, but before you do that, make sure that you put it in the freezer for like a few hours, two to three, and you could definitely have that for snack in the night or with a lunch as long as you add nuts and fruits. So before that, let me drink my green juice. So we're going to get a container. Depending on what you want it, that's how your container should be. So for example, you have this size, which I'm going to show you more. You have, depending what type of size you want, you're going to get a container to put your ingredients inside. So I'm going to make two. I'm going to make two. Am I the only person who have a thousand containers for no reason we're missing tops i need to get my drills together 
make sure whatever container you do get, um, you have a top for it because you want to cover it before you put it in the freezer. Just put your milk inside of your container. You can take this for work, for school. So, you could put, I would say, one third. Syrup. Vanilla. I'm gonna open it like the top. You're going to go ahead. You might need to put more chia seeds, so just go ahead and put it. I added the ingredients just in case. I think I need to put more. Before dinner time, I got a package and I wanted to show you guys my Alani that I got. It's already dinner time and I'm going to be showing you how to do bistec with white rice and a side of spinach. I feel like there's just some dishes that are so special to you because they bring you or they or they take you back to when you was younger. And these and this dish is one of those dishes. Cut your onions, add salt, pepper, vinegar, olive oil, and put it in a bowl. Before your meat is done, you add it to your biste. I like my spinach a little bit more, um, with more flavor, so I always start with the spinach first. And there you have it, a delicious, healthy lunch. Ready? Be sure to check out my latest short on my Instagram. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, and also subscribe for more content like this. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on my next video.